So even when the village shaman would try to call down the vengeance of the moon upon his enemies, he was still a snappy dresser. <laughs> now I hope that some of these native artifacts are going to inspire some culturally diverse costume choices this Halloween. What's inspired for me is a nap. Oh, I miss naps. The dreaming, the snoring, the drooling. Since when did you give up drooling? Oh, naps. Here's a sight for scary eyes. According to native legend, an ancient warlord would use this mask to bring to life the fighting spirits of his army. And the warlord's warriors would don the furs of wolves and bears. And then, you know what would happen? Animal rights groups would protest? They smell like old carcasses? No. The natives believed the warriors would turn into actual wolves and bears. Oh, scary stuff, eh, kids? I saw that you were sleeping, Rory. I was just pretending to sleep. Oh, great. Well, now you can pretend to stay after class and clean the blackboards. It seems like I'm doing this for real. I don't like giving real detention, so I, I try to turn them into imagination time. It, uh, it helps me manage my guilt. Oh, uh, don't touch those artifacts. Okay. The warlord shaman will touch everything. are you for math not very hello vampire halloween party how cool does that sound a lot cooler than babysitting because i need money no you're not this is our first vampire halloween party well if i explain it to ethan's mom that way i'm sure she'll give me the night off it was gonna be great maybe but not as awesome as the night where i dressed up as butter and you were salt when we did the popcorn dance in the theater Try to cheer me up. I am grumpy. What's wrong with Erica? She keeps grumbling about popcorn prices. Ugh, I told her I couldn't go to a Halloween party with her tonight because I have to babysit. I wish I could just have fun tonight. No offense. Yeah, I feel really bad about that. Hey, I'm having a party later tonight. You could babysit that? You're having a Halloween party? Yeah, sure. Why not? Because it'll just be the two of us. That's why. Are you seriously trying to tell me that we don't have a dozen friends with ready-to-wear costumes and no Halloween plans? We invite the mathletes and we're halfway there. Aww. You really want to make Sarah's night, don't you? I just don't want to ruin her night. Anyways, we could at least invite Rory. What? Do you remember what happened last time? I'm a caveman! I'm a caveman! I'm a caveman! Oh, I'm a caveman! I'm a caveman! And that wasn't even a costume party. Look, I'm sure he'll be better this time. I still think that's better. Dang, yeah. So, I'll be home by 11. Have fun with your friends. And don't forget to take Jane trick-or-treating. I can't forget what I never remember. Wow, do all of those Dust characters really talk like that? Yeah, especially Jake Word. He's thoughtful. And very handsome. 
thought you hated all that stuff. How come you're dressed like him? Hey, Sarah. Who are you dressed up as? I'm Rochelle from Dusk. Oh, I see. Okay, well, have a good time, guys. See you, Mom. Take word, huh? You should really pop the collar. Much better. Yes, better. So, what's your name? Beep, bop, boop, boop, beep, beep, bop, boop. Behold, Insaniac, the crazy supercomputer. Super! Hey, pretty cool party, huh? Insaniac has been beeping at me for 20 minutes. To be fair, he does that even when he's not in costume. Look, I know this isn't the night you had in mind, but try and have some fun. Go and dance with Finjo over there. That costume doesn't even make sense. If he's a fish, how is he supposed to breathe on land? Finjo's half dolphin. They breathe air. What you should be mad about is that plastic sword. Not authentic. Arriba! Who are you supposed to be? Well, I couldn't decide between Merlin and the Mexican wrestler, so I picked both. Say hola to El Merlo Loco, the wizard wrestler who combines the best of the arcane and the insane. <laughs> hey, White Chapel, are you ready to party? <laughs> wow, compared to the Zerka's traditional vampire Halloween, is starting to sound like a blast. I can't believe you got us kicked out of that party, you goon. Rory. <laughs> this is the worst night ever. I can't believe I'm going to do this. Erica? What happened to your traditional vampire night? Rory got us booted. He wouldn't take off that stupid mask. So, where is he? He was following me, so I threw him. I'm not quite sure where he ended up. Oh, I'm glad you're here. This party is way under control. At least I can have fun with you. Yeah? Great. Do you know where I can set up my meditation blanket? Your what? That's how we celebrate the true vampire Halloween. Have any candles? No. All right. Look. The green ones don't taste as green as they used to. Hey, you're supposed to take me trick-or-treating. Let's go. Time is candy. Okay, okay. Go get your whiskers in a knot. Can I come with you? Girl, Ella won't stop flirting with me. <laughs> Dude, she's flirting with me. <laughs> as if. Sarah, I'll be back in a bit. What are you doing? If we're doing this, I'm gonna break my record. 11.28 pounds. Yeah. Meow? Meow? Oh, what a sweet little mouse. Huh? Here, dear. <sighs> oh, my. Children certainly are getting tall these days. Uh, are you sure you're not too old to be doing this? Uh, let me get my glasses out. Uh, no! Hey. I, I love recess and balloons and that cartoon about that bouncy thing. All right, then. There you go. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> That's really cool, but you're going to chop somebody. Take it easy. What is with these nerds? <laughs> Are you serious? Well, 
That house is a candy gold mine. Their fun size bars are actually fun. You have 14 pounds of seed mints. A record's a record. Eric, I need. What are you doing? Trying to meditate. Can you come downstairs for a minute? I can't. I have to commune with my inner predator, or else I won't be cleansed enough for. Chapter three. But I seriously need a hand. The nerd fest down there is getting a little rowdy. Since you put it that way, no. Can you keep the music down? That's ten houses. We got enough yet? I want to find Benny and get back to the party. Yep, good enough. I'll be sick tomorrow for sure. Ugh. Oh man. I thought the seeds would be the worst part. It's clearly the mint. Now open your mouth and say ah. I said, are you ready to party? Indeed. Now take two gumdrops and call me last night. Hey, Kevin. Want a seedment? What I want can't be found in all tomorrow's yesterdays. Wow. That's a really good Doctor Wen impression. Somebody's a fanboy. I have to go. I'll be here any minute. Don't leave yet. We're gonna order six feet of pizza from Pizza. Was that as impossible as I think it was? <laughs> that looks like a real sword. That sounds and smells like a real gorilla. What day is it? What day is it? Something's not right here. I know. This party is awesome. I never knew our friends were so much fun. I don't think they are. Hey, Rory. Pete Mask. Uh, Rory, what's going on here? I need <laughs> Jane? Hey, we took you trick or treating, you rug rat. There you are! Okay. Did Rory just turn Jane into a cat? I don't know what's happening, but he really got this party started. He's wearing that native mask from Mr. G's class. What did Mr. G say it did? You're asking me to remember something from class? Figure it out later. Stop it now. We can't let a gorilla and a ninja out onto the streets. I got this. Groundus, Darmicus. That's the spell grandma uses to ground me. No one gets outside. Ethan, I'm home. What about inside? It doesn't do it that way. Mom? Quiet! Not another word, or I'll turn you into a toad. <laughs> Can she be? Ethan, please don't jump out at me again. It was so disgusting to catch you. You know, I think he's cuter as a toad. All right, stand back. Amphibia, Formus, Malnath, Actopus. What? What is it? Uh, nothing. Everything is fine. You do not have a hideous toad head. That's my next five nightmares. What? Why did I just rip it? Okay, no, I got it now. I know what I did wrong. Amphibiar Returnus Malnath Ectopers. Hey! I'll freak out about this later. Let's get to work. Erica, help me find Jane. She's sort of a cat now. Fine. I will help you find your cat, then that is it. I need to shun the material world and and feel the pulse of lifeblood. That sounds that sounds awesome. So an ancient warlord used this mask to turn his warriors into wolves and bears. We know that. What happens after? 
the gods were angry with this warlord, so they blasted his mask off with a bolt of lightning, and his warriors turned back to normal. Can you lightning the mask off? This is 15,000 year old magic. Only a big time wizard would have this kind of power. A wizard like El Merlo Loco? Sure. He's awesome. But he's just a costume. Ethan, am I supposed to go down there and get Roy to turn me into the real El Merlo Loco so I can have the magic horsepower to stop him? Okay, just reach in and grab her. You have longer arms. Ow! Whatever, she's safe. Things under the bed are safe. Let's close the door and leave her in here. She has hands. She can open a door. Fine. Hey, Jean! Come on! Do you want a treat? Kitty, kitty! Kitty! That'll keep her busy. We're done. Okay. Oh! oh. Great warlord, uh, your army has an ape uh, and a butler, uh, but you're missing a mighty wizard uh, like me. Uh, hey, Penny, get that lightning going. It's almost midnight. We need to get Roy's mask off. Okay. Don't tell me. You don't speak English. Ah, Z. Z. Bueno. Adiós, amigo. Bueno. Ah. Roy, no! Ah, ah. Ethan! You feel okay? The name's Jake Ward. And I feel everything. Except okay. Okay. <laughs> Get really bien. All my brew needs now is a fat, juicy child. Mas <laughs> cebollas. <laughs> Tal vez. Ooh. Need your help. Benny doesn't speak English and Ethan won't stop brooding. <sighs> See? All I wanted was a quiet vampire ritual. One that turned out to be boring and confusing and it's making me feel like 500 years old. <sighs> I've had it. I've had it. <sighs> it is nerd bashing time, folks. My heart doesn't beat. It feels so beaten. Wow. Adios. I'm a 
place it is almost become this. Jeffrey, you're in danger! Amigo! Ayuda! Está aquí! Everything I ever wanted, everywhere. And you're all the nothing I ever have to lose. Oh. Manos electricos. Huh? Huh? Are you ready to have that mask come off? Let me hear you. I don't know, but must have been for a good reason, right? It's not good enough. Is this a party? Am I invited? Oh, my head. Oh. Okay, none of this makes sense. Help! I'm stuck under the bed! Has anyone seen my hamster? Ethan! Yeah? Did you have some kind of wild, out-of-control Halloween party? Kinda? Maybe? Really? Wow. Oh. Good for you. I knew you could do it. And by the way, you're grounded.